the wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Manchester City. They take on Inter next on EA TV. Well, there's nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crowd. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined as always on these big occasions by Stuart Robson. It is Manchester City up against Inter. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. City lineup. Ederson begins in goal. Manuel Akanji plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Erling Haaland. lineup is as follows. Alessandro Bastoni plays with Milan Skriniar in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today, Lautaro Martinez plays alongside Edin Dzeko. This is it, the Champions League final. They are underway. Who will be crowned club kings of Europe? Could it keep the ball? Gundogan. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Real chance. Oh, there is the goal that gives Inter the lead in the final. Exactly what they were hoping for. Well, as you see, it's not a good pass out from the back. It's on the wrong side of the plane he's trying to pass it to. It's intercepted, and it's a good finish. Yes, of course it is, but it's not good defending all round. So City get things going again, and the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Clean challenge. And space here on the flank. Into the middle from Bernardo Silva. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Opportunity it is. And it's offside. That was very close. De Bruyne, space afforded him, Holland, nothing positive comes of it unfortunately, Holland, Holland, well the keeper had a lot of ground to cover, splendid save, elects to go short,
a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. It was intended for Dzeko. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and what about the finish? With such control and technique, that could have gone anywhere, but not with his skill. It's a great goal. So, the ball rolling again, and 2-0. Silva losing it. A real opening now. A goal as they cut it to their advantage. Still plenty of life in this match. Well, here it is. 1v1 against the keeper and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. Continuing with the game, City just one behind now. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Di Marco. And he takes on the shot. Well, in some style, Edison prevents a goal. Now, how about the short corner? And he favours the inside route. Well, there you can see Inter haven't been able to control the possession, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Well, it looked as though they might be in just for a second or two. Oh, he looks threatening. And able to get a body in the way. Sloppy there, Bernardo Silva. They've got it now, what can they do? And quite simply, wide of the target. Silva. Nicely timed tackle. Over the touchline for what will be an inter throw. Well, on the verge of hearing the half-time whistle and City narrowly behind. Stuart, your assessment... Oh, Derek, can he finish this? And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. Who can they pick out? Well, really stout defending there. Off the line. Really good high press. It's going to be a City ball. And the whistle is sounded for half. Into the second half then in this battle for Champions League glory. Martinez. 
Now they've lost it. Gundogan. I think the referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. Well, now he's walking on eggshells, you might say. Next time it'll be yellow. And that's an important intervention. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. A sloppy pass. Breaking at pace. A timely defending when it mattered. Real chance. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And this is Haaland at his very best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the keeper. Not many sides would have the mental strength to bounce back from adversity like this team. Kevin De Bruyne couldn't keep the ball. And City get the throw in. Holland. Chance to take the lead. And a goal to put them in front. Real drama here. Let's take another look, and I'm not sure what the keeper was thinking there. Just look at his position. He made it far too easy for him to score. <laughs> On with the game then. 3-2. What will happen next? He read the situation defensively and did his job. Holland. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Grealish. On to De Bruyne. Well timed tackle. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Gundogan. Well, that's a well-timed pass. And still trying to get the shot off. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Martinez. Martinez! Quite simply, an opportunity wasted. Easy for the keeper. Here it is now, a substitution. And there's the delivery. Not quite spot on with that one. Oh, you don't want to lose the ball in that position. De Frey. This could level it. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity.
goalkeeper reacting just as we would have expected. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving because it's still close. This could be the equaliser. Well denied by the keeper, but really he only has himself to blame. Doesn't want to lose his cool here. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Martinez! Terrific save. And if you're wondering about out of time, two minutes it'll be. And there it is, full-time Manchester City Champions League winners. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Manchester City. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. The Champions League victors, Manchester City.